I want to have more conversations with people that are maybe dissatisfied with the current model of like how we're doing solving the culture war that kind of look at it and go, I'm getting exhausted. I feel like I haven't moved an inch. Like I, you know, I read and read and read and nothing happens. Um, to me, that's the right conversation. And, and I love having that. I just don't have it very often. And to me, that's fuel for the work. I think some of what we need is more people who do want to abandon the win-lose zero-sum game um, and try to find a different path forward to engage in conflict that's generative, conflict that maybe takes you to a different place than you originally thought, but it's still a positive place. Um, and also, you know, folks who are willing to compromise. Um, you know, one of the things that the council does is, is we're up on Capitol Hill all the time looking for ways to expand philanthropy and, and policies that support the missions of our members and the communities that they serve. And nothing happens on the Hill without, um, without a, a coalition of folks who on a lot of things disagree. Um, so, you know, they're not modeling, they're not modeling the way on a lot of, um, you know, on a lot of behaviors, um, including compromise, but, you know, the fact that compromise uh, is now demonized is, is a problem, um, because that is, mm -hmm. that is very much zero-sum thinking.